Hey, this is Mike Rowan with Dark Angel Medical with another one of our free online training classes. Today I'm going to be talking about the SOFT Wide, which stands for Special Operations Forces Tactical Tourniquet Wide. I think it wins the award for the longest acronym in medical. So with that, uh, same kind of concept as the CAT Tourniquet, which you already learned about, it has a windlass. This one is aluminum. It also has a windlass retention, and specifically on that, this is a triangle instead. One of the unique features about this tourniquet is its quick disconnect buckle, like so. So I'm gonna show you placement on an arm, and then in a little bit, I'll show you how to place it on a leg. So on an arm, it's very, very similar to the cat tourniquet, but at this point, I don't know, it's very hard to get that cinch down. So what I do is I pretend like I'm holding an apple with my armpit, and then I can ratchet it down, and therefore cinching it nice and tight. From here, I bring the windlass over where I have a good view of that triangle. And I cinch this down. Now the hardest part with this tourniquet and why a lot of folks uh, struggle with it is getting it on and securing that triangle on the windlass one-handed. It's definitely gonna take some practice. But once it's on, going high and tight like we've talked about, I have this tourniquet placed. A unique feature about the soft T-wide is instead of marking on the windlass retention strap, we're marking on the strap itself the time that you placed for those medics. Now, you may have noticed that ratcheting motion kind of gives you a little bit of a struggle. So with that, there's another technique that I don't recommend using our trainers in our trainer class with because a lot of people have had hands-on with it. But once you have that tourniquet looped up with that high and tight, I can actually grab with my teeth and slide down and then begin that windlass turn. All right, so. I've showed you a couple different ways to put it on your arm. Now, one of the great features about this is in fact that quick, uh, quick disconnect buckle. So I'm gonna show you throwing it on a leg right here on my film crew. So from here, the key is once I place it underneath the leg, I wanna weave it all the way up as high as I can as I'm doing that weaving. Once I get that quick disconnect on, very, very easy to cinch that down and I could actually use the windlass to get that extra cinch. From there, I'm going to turn until that tourniquet is secure, lock that in place, and I'm gonna mark that time on that tail. With all that said, you may have saw me trying to put that on my arm and thought, but Mike, the cat tourniquet's much easier to put on one-handed. So there are pros and cons to both of the tourniquets. The pro for the cat tourniquet being a very easy one-handed application. Now for the soft tee wide, the biggest pro that I've found and why I personally carry it as part of my everyday carry, not so much my range carry, is because it's very, very small and compact. So with that, this particular tourniquet is about the size of a cell phone, so it can fit nice and easily in a pocket, in your ankle rig, or otherwise. Now the second half of that, one of the biggest things that you may have saw in the video earlier is I was using an older trainer. This is the latest generation of the Soft T Wide, and they have actually beefed up that buckle and made it much, much more secure getting that snapped into place. Otherwise, the windlass and the windlass retention triangle remains the same. That's all I got for the Soft T Wide. Stay tuned for more free videos from Dark Angel Medical.